high social media. I was just thinking, uh, and I don't know what made me get this train of thought up about missed opportunities in business. Missed opportunities in business. I think that there are opportunities that we miss in the business world that pretty much start directing how we operate in the business world if we allow it to. All of us have had that season where we didn't take advantage of an opportunity. All of us have had a season where we didn't uh, perform as best we could on, in a job setting. All of us have that litany of nightmarish business actions that you can think, maybe somebody else doesn't know anything about them, but you know. And all of the opportunities sometimes that we had in business that falls through our grip or slips through our hands and the person to blame is the person that looks just like you look in the mirror on a daily basis. Folks, as long as time in, there's going to be some, as long as you're a business person, there's going to be something in your business background that you, where you have squandered an opportunity where maybe something really lucrative, maybe an opportunity that really would have put you on the map, that really would have set your finances free, and you allowed it to slip, probably because sometimes it wasn't a white right season. Sometimes making all the money in the world in the wrong season, probably still, it, 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 it could have been detrimental to your life. I, I thank God that everything that I want now in my 50s, that he sure didn't give them to me in my 20s or 30s because I might not be here in my 50s to tell, tell you about them. But what I've noticed is there is a tendency to mourn missed opportunities. And all of us have had great opportunities. And there's this uh, thought that a great opportunity won't come your way again. I had resigned myself from, for a season, from thoughts of ever uh, doing it big again. You got to give yourself, as a business person, the permission to reinvent yourself. Folks, look, that opportunity may be, be gone from your grasp. It may have been missed. But the opportunity bank isn't bankrupt. Life is full of opportunities. Life is full of redos. Life is full of rehashes. Folks, there's opportunities. I could look back in my life and some opportunities that came early in my 20s in the automobile business where I sat down uh, with a guy, uh, one of my heroes still to this day, I won't call his name because I think he's still alive, but I'll keep our private conversation to ourselves. But he was telling me that by such and such age, I could have the four cars, I could have the mansion on the hill, I could own multiple dealerships and be that M word. Well, didn't really capitalize on that opportunity. Uh, sitting down with the presiding bishop of the Church of God in Christ, as far as black preachers are concerned, one of the greatest to ever do it, G.E. Patterson, and he said, Smith, if you're going to leave me, write down what you need me to do and present it back to me. Well, not that I felt like I was too good for him, but I just did not want to be one of those that I had heard him uh, have people who had burned him in the past. But that was an opportunity that was squandered. When somebody that has a big enough checkbook to write a check that can change your life. But even that wasn't the end of it. Folks, look, each day you got some new mercies. And with it, it, when you wake up in a world and there are no problems, then you won't have another business opportunity. But I've never woke up one day to find a world that didn't have any problems. If you wake up and there's a problem, that's a business opportunity. There's always some other thing that you can do. You got to give yourself permission 
to reinvent yourself. I know some of you have given uh, 20 years, 30 years, and I'm not talking about it. It's great to be with an awesome company. I've been with one for 12 years now. When you're uh, doing that which aligns with your passion, that which makes you sparkle, that which makes you think as swiftly as you can, but you got to give yourself permission from some of the uh, some of the bones and skeletons in your business background. Folks, it's always another season, always another opportunity. Now you're looking at the age as a deterrent. You say, well, I could have done that if I had that opportunity in my 30s or 40s. If you really want to be honest, most people do life-changing things in business sometimes after their 50s. I think Colonel Sanders was almost 60 and did something in his 60s. And so many other business people. Folks, look, get yourself out of the business doldrums. There's always, yeah, you miss some opportunities, but we live in a world with huge opportunities that are presented on a daily basis. I, I think uh, if you chronicle Abraham Lincoln's life, and it goes over all the failures, failures, failures he had, and he kept on and kept on, and sooner or later he was president of the United States. Uh, look, you have to have the ability to move on from some of your missed opportunities. If you spend time focusing on the opportunities that have been missed, sometimes uh, your own fault. You're, you're the sole reason why that opportunity left. I think I had an opportunity once uh, right around, uh, gosh, I've been around 2000, 2001-ish, uh, where somebody gave me a figure, and that figure was astounding in 2021, but that figure was given to me in 2001, but I still squandered the opportunity because I let somebody uh, get me upset and I walked away from the opportunity. Folks, look, you can go back and count and do the math and where I would have been making that kind of money in that time, but sooner or later, sometimes you have to go through uh, the training school or the university called life. There will be some opportunities that you'll miss. There'll be some opportunities that I miss. But the world, you can never see the world in the framework of your missed opportunities. There'll always be some other opportunity. As long as the world got, has a problem, it also has an opportunity. Forgive yourself. Stop taking or being so hard on yourself. The world is full of new opportunities. So you definitely don't have to focus on the missed ones. Yes, I got some that could have uh, certain behaviors at certain times a little earlier because I had opportunities so quick. I had opportunities so quick and when you're quick, you don't have everything out of your system. I had opportunities so quick and everybody marveled at the skill set and marveled at the talent. Now, that talent has an older framework. Maybe I wish that I had the mind that I have now with some of the opportunities that I had back when, but God has made none of us time travelers. So you have to be resolute and know maybe I missed it then, but I'm going to take advantage of the opportunities that are around me right now. Have an awesome day.